Welcome back everyone to Moons and Pearls. I'm here to do a spiritual update for Virgo. Virgo, how are you guys doing? Thank you all of you for all of your love and patience. Um, I am just so grateful for each and every one of you guys and to all of our new subscribers, welcome. Um, if you haven't already done so, make sure you like, share and subscribe. Um, we would love to have you. All right, you guys, let's see what's going on in the general energy for Virgo. <clears throat> let's see what's going on with Virgo. What's in the general energy for Virgo? General energy for Virgo. Okay. I feel like you are currently trying to find your path and your way, Virgo. Um, you're definitely someone that stands out from a group of friends um, and you're going through a rebirth. When I talk about this authenticity card, it's so important for you to remain true to yourself no matter the, the peer pressure or what's going on around you because you are special the way that you are. Um, and then you're still trying to find your path, whether that's in the career or personal life choices, but you're going through a rebirth. You might be... Um, I, I'm even seeing like changing your style, the way that you dress um, and asking yourself different questions about how you can do things better. Um, so I, I definitely see some changes in your physical appearance, um, but remember to stay true to yourself. That's important. Um, no matter what is going on around you, a new beginning or fresh start on the, is on the horizon. This can be in any area of your life. You're currently in a, in a time of powerful transformation. Embrace it. The more open you are, the easier you will incorporate this change. And so this little bit of a blockage is um, feeling a little bit lost or on autopilot, but I feel like you're getting the groove of this transformation or what you're going through right now. All right, Virgo, let's talk about challenges. What's been challenging Virgo? If you haven't already done so, make sure you like, share, subscribe, you guys. Let's see what's been <clears throat> challenging Virgo. It's been a challenge for Virgo. Challenge for Virgo. That's made you, I don't want to say lose people, um, but just people or situations that, that don't serve you are not in your life anymore. Um, I also see like mental confusion about what it is that you truly want in life sometimes. So maybe it's something about being married or more abundant or dedicating more time in your career or freedom so I feel like your mind's been a little bit all over the place in terms of what you want in your life um I feel like there's people that are yeah, there's a lot about you being very honest very clear um not budging with your boundaries and then people feeling sad or sorry for um not having you in their life anymore but I feel like you've moved on you're moving forward I don't feel like you give this situation or people a second thought. Virgo. All right, let's see what's in your current energy. Current energy for Virgo. <clears throat> current energy for Virgo. Apologize. Apologizing. Apologies coming through. Um, people watching you move on, doing new things, <clears throat> creating your. That's what you're doing. I feel like you're creating your your life, your lifestyle. There's someone here that I feel like is not accepting you moving forward. Cancer energy. Um, maybe I feel like maybe you're a very nice person, but someone's apologized, but it feels manipulative, or that you don't really trust what they say. Um, it's almost like this person looks like they have the it life. No one talk about you. I'm talking about some other energy. They have the it life, the looks, the everything, and I feel like they're manipulative in terms of getting close to you for specific reasons. Okay. 
yeah you might this might be someone that you used to go out with or you still go out for beverages with them every now and then but i don't uh see this person as a very trustworthy friend or person around you virgo yeah <clears throat> so i feel like you've you've taken a step back and just looking at the decisions that you're making and what you're allowing in your life okay let's see what's coming towards you in the near future okay this one's come out a couple of times so i feel like virgo sometimes when you feel hurt so you keep it to yourself you don't really talk about it um so the fact that the challenge has been that you speak about it i feel like there's going to be things in the near future where you're going to try to hide it or suppress it um and then you're going to decide is it even worth mentioning it um <clears throat> But I feel, yeah, this is this is coming off as, um, I don't even know that you would talk about it. I feel like you are just going to pull your energy from situations. Um, I see you, or I feel, here's the decision and decisions and decisions. I feel you just being uh, colder um, in a way. Um, what's the advice for Virgo from this deck? <clears throat> what's the advice for Virgo from this deck? <clears throat> conflict um i feel like there's just an, an energy of avoid conflict don't dirty your energy if possible stand up if you have to um but if it's not worth your you wasting your time or energy then there you go we have woof emphasize the connection with your intuition and instinct so you know that what you feel inside that instinct you have to know that those feelings are real, okay? Um, let's see, what do we have here from this? Bring love into the situation. But I see, when I look at this picture, I see this um, beautiful um, person or woman bringing love into herself. Have faith in your dreams. Um, there's like flower fields and stuff like that. Hold your vision. So continue manifesting. Don't allow other energies or situations to unbalance what you're manifesting through. Um, let me know, you guys, if these messages have resonated. I enjoy reading your comments and messaging with you guys. Exactly. Beautiful cards um, for your self-care. We have move. A long walk is good for the soul. Get outside and allow Mother Na Nature to lift your spirits. Um, shine don't dim your life the world needs your unique talents and gifts shine brightly and we have beauty today you are a curator of beauty you are blessed with moments that let you know beyond the shadow of a doubt that all is well in the world um and again virgo you're bringing this energy a very a very beautiful energy very handsome very very sweet and caring so don't um dim your light to please others okay you are wonderful no need to worry is here the answer is no <clears throat> an opportunity with lots of money i feel like abundance so let's read the opportunity for you guys positive growth and expansion is on the horizon for you which is the rebirth that we talked about at the beginning of the reading this opportunity may bring with it inspiration and insight or it could be the chance you've been waiting for to take action on ideas you already have. You may be seeking to manifest a chance to create changes in your career, buy or sell a home, or bring romance into your life. Whatever your desires, your angels are about to open a door of possibilities for you. Step right through. All right, very well, this was your reading. If you haven't already done so, make sure you like, share, subscribe. You already know we would be so happy to have you guys. And we'll see you soon. Ciao.